Hey, it's Amand here. In this tutorial, I want to show you how to create an offer in Kajabi so you can start selling your online course or your service or pre-sell something. So this is a sale that I'm doing, which is very simple. And I wanted to create a simple checkout page and I wanted to record my video showing exactly how to create an offer in Kajabi. Also because their interface has recently changed and I think it'll be valuable for somebody to see step-by-step -step how I set it up. So let me share my screen. First of all, you want to click on sales. Once you are in sales, you will be able to click on a button which is called new offer. Click on new offer on the right and then it will take you to the new interface of setting up an offer in Kajabi. Now you want to give a offer title. In this case, I'm going to call this courses DCT course beta tester. And basically, I'm not going to give access to the course here particularly. It's just not relevant in this case. I'm simply selling it and I'll give them access separately. Then I'm going to now click on paid and I can choose if it's going to be a one time, if it's a subscription, if it's a multi pay, i.e. payment plan. In this case, it's a one time payment and it's $19. So I'm going to do that. Then I'm going to say which option do I want people to use Stripe or use PayPal. In this case, I'm going to give them an option to do both. I'm going to click on save and finish. Note that my courses are actually hosted on system.io and therefore I'm simply using this for my checkout. Um, if you're interested to learn more, I have a tutorial that explains the difference between Kajabi and system and you can check it out for yourself. It's somewhere on my YouTube channel. You see it somewhere around here. Once I've got this part set up, what I'm gonna do is I'm going to scroll down and in this case, post purchase, I'm going to set up a custom thank you page. And that thank you page is gonna be a simple text and I'm going to say, thank you so much for purchasing one of my DCT courses to be a beta tester. Please email me right now to contact at aranbukai.com to let me know what course you would like access to. Here are your options. Now let me just grab the link with the option. So I've given them a bunch of, a bunch of options. Here's the five. I'm gonna go back to Kajabi, paste it in. I'm gonna delete this thing again. And final reminder, once you actually do the course and provide me with a testimonial for it, I will credit you the $19 for any product or service of mine in form of a coupon code whenever you are ready to purchase any of my other products or services. Thanks for being a beta tester, I greatly appreciate it. Okay, so that's the thank you page. Now I can click here on preview thank you page. What it will do, it will open up and actually show exactly what that would look like. Now, you'll notice that with Kajabi, usually you have to save, so I'm gonna click on save because the preview doesn't actually show it unless it's saved, okay? So I'm gonna, now that I've saved it, you'll see the content right here. Now. The formatting is really minimal, unfortunately, on this type of a page, so it's just gonna have to be that way. No big deal, I'm, I'm, not, uh, I'm not too fussy about it right now. Okay, now, I'm going to now make this none, no post purchase email. In some cases, you wanna do the default email, which is basically going to be the email that will give them access to the course. In this case, because I'm not giving them access to the course in Kajabi, I'm not gonna do that. And then I'm gonna take this text on the thank you page, and I'm gonna add an automation. This automation is going to be when somebody purchases, I'm going to send them an email automatically. And here is the email. It's gonna be the same basically. Pay and then first name, personalize. Thank you for purchasing one of my courses. Please reply to this email to let me know which course you would like access. <clears throat> here are the options. Thanks for being a beta tester. Send it to the person. And that's that. Now I can also set up upsells and downsells and all that stuff. In this particular case, I am actually not doing any of that stuff. It is purely a beta tester and that's it. Um, yeah, that's all. So now that offer is done. That is as minimal as it gets. I can now 
um, go and click on edit checkout and in the checkout I'm now going to be basically setting up what people are actually buying and I'm going to set up the, the checkout page so first of all I'm going to delete this banner right here on the very top so let me just move my face over so I can be smaller so um, let me just remove this you can see that I disabled the banner so it's not even visible at all I'm gonna click here I'm gonna replace this text thank you so much for your interest to be a beta tester for one of my DCT courses here are your options um, go ahead and make the purchase now and email me which ones you want access to okay so that's that I'm gonna click on save you'll see all this is replaced okay now I'm gonna click here I'm gonna click on design make the primary color my brand color go back additional settings returning members don't need to log in it's very important because otherwise it's just a, uh, it's just a pain because they have to log in so you don't I don't want that now I'm gonna do a service agreement like you could do I confirm but I can I blah 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 I, I'm not gonna actually do a service agreement doesn't really matter in this case order bump do I want an order bump uh, yeah I'll do an order bump so I'm going to do join my tech support membership for a one dollar trial for the next seven days and then be charged 197 um, a quarter be part of my DCT membership current pricing is 99 a month and so this option to join the membership is the lowest price publicly available okay now I'm gonna click on save I'm gonna need to change the word upsell so it doesn't say upsell <laughs> okay so I'm gonna do that but that's a good little upsell upsells are always you know order bumps upsells very very important you have those in terms of the field I am going to collect their name I am going to collect their address as well um, because if they're in Australia I need to know because uh, I pay extra 10% on that on them uh, for tax purposes okay so I've gone in and I've changed it so it doesn't say the word upsell and I'm just going to say join the text on membership for a dollar trial for the next seven days and then be charged one seven for and um, yeah and then I'm going to say on the order bump if you have your onboarding call with my virtual assistant and see what this membership is all about only if you decide to stay while on the trial will you then be charged to continue to be part of the DCT membership you will be locked in at this 197 a quarter price for as long as you remain a member cool okay I'm gonna click on save now I'm gonna click on get link copy link I'm gonna go to incognito click on the paste button and then let's just see what it looks like make sure we're happy with it yep perfect that looks good one last thing I will do also just because I have a little bit of a preference for it is I actually prefer the design of this page um, to be let me just show you use legacy checkout I kind of prefer that I'll show you what I mean by that so basically they will only see the order bump after they enter their name and email okay so now I'm gonna click on get link copy um, incognito paste this in and then they will not actually see the order bump up until they enter the name and email so enter the name and email and only then they'll see the order bump so that's that click on save click on back to the offer now this is the correct link to grab copy it uh, now I can email it to people who have said yes I want to buy so that's about it that's how you do an offer in Kajabi uh, if you have any additional questions about Kajabi creating offers anything along these lines please let me know in the comment if you found value in this video please leave the word in the comment that says value 
And if you want me to record a specific tutorial on Kajabi, feel free to let me know. Leave a comment below with what tutorial you'd like me to record and I'll definitely make sure I do so. Thanks a lot. I'll speak to you soon. Thanks a lot for watching this Kajabi tutorial. If you want to get some extra tutorials on Kajabi, please leave a comment below and I'll be happy to create them as soon as I get a chance. If you're not a Kajabi customer and you want to explore the features and things along these lines, I have a link for you to check it out. Go to aranbukai.com forward slash Kajabi, create a free account, play around with it and so on. If you want also, I will actually do a free consultation with you to actually help you get set up with Kajabi because it does take a little bit of a learning curve. So we will actually hop on a Zoom call for half an hour and get that learning curve shortened a little bit so you can actually make progress faster. So again, go to aranbukai.com forward slash Kajabi and I look forward to hearing from you. Thanks a lot. I'll speak to you soon.